Very good, sir, I said. And I said it very calmly, but I was very excited. Wolf Goose Pigwig is not only the most famous opera singer in the world, he is also famous for being very, very fancy. His music is fancy, his clothes are fancy, his wigs are fancy, so very, very fancy. Finally, I would have my chance to buttle for someone who truly wanted things fancy. I could serve fancy tea from a fancy teapot into a fancy cup. My lifelong dream was about to come true. Wolf Goose Pigwig told me that his driver would pick me up in front of my apartment building in one hour. He told me exactly what to wear. My fanciest tuxedo, my fanciest tie, and my fanciest cummerbund. Which is that fancy thing that goes across your stomach. Very good, sir, I said, and I meant it. This is what a butler lives for. Pigwig hung up without another word. I had a lot to do to get ready, but first I called my mom. Mom, I got a job, the perfect job. I'm going to the Huba Hustle Music Festival with... Oh, honey, I'm so proud of you, she gushed. You're going to be a hip-hop star at last. Uh, no, I said. I'm going to be a butler. What? Didn't Crystal Wombat call you? Wasn't she looking for a hot hip-hop hit record? Well, yes, I admitted. But I don't want to make hot records. I want to be a butler. Not that again, groaned my mom.